So in case you guys wanted a lazy Sunday OOTD, I thought I'd give one to you because I'm looking pretty cool right now. So what you are going to need is a dressing gown, uh, really messy hair from last night, bed hair, uh, a t-shirt, just a, a big t-shirt, a big comfy t-shirt, probably black because it's a flattering colour. Um, some tights, also black, and some pink bunny slippers with ears and a little tail. So that is my Sunday, Lazy Sunday OOTD. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, you know, I don't mean to like show off, but I just thought you guys would be interested. I just got home from TAFE and I'm eating a wagon wheel and I got a facial today and my skin feels amazing and I gave a facial today like, like a full like there was like three different machinery like things that we had to do with it as well it was fun it was a bit tedious I'm not gonna lie but it was still fun I'm still into it so that's good I don't know what else to say does it count as a mukbang if I like eat this whole biscuit then can I put it in the title <laughs> I'm like out of breath from like running to my car. <laughs> it is Tuesday, it's like 5-ish p.m. My eyebrow is a lot darker than that one, that's okay. I just finished work, just a little three hour shift. I'm very tired, now I'm gonna go home, eat something because I'm really hungry, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> eat something, watch something, do some homework because I need to do it, that's, that's all. Loving life right now. <laughs> I'm off to work. So guys, I just drove to work and I'm about to go into the shopping center and go to work. Um, I'm not really having a great day today. Nothing's really happened. I just don't. You know when you have those days where you just feel disgusting. Like you feel like you look gross. You feel like everything you do isn't really going right, and you feel like panicky. Like I'm having one of those days, and it's gonna be really interesting because I feel like last time I had a day like this work was not very fun I literally wanted to cry like the whole time because of myself not anyone else <laughs> but like I'm just really not loving it today not looking forward to it at all so hopefully we can get through this and then I'll have some motivational talk afterwards maybe maybe not because I have to get out of here before I have to pay extra for parking, maybe, I don't know. Last time I year I got free parking, a few times it's happened, sometimes you have to pay and it's like seven bucks, which for me, I mean, it's fine, but it's also a bit much, so I don't know. I'm also shaking, sorry if that's like, <laughs> I'm like not in a mood, in a good mood today. Anyway, I'm gonna go, yeah. <laughs> So guys, the motivational chat that I have prepared for you in my brain the whole day is that if you really don't enjoy your job and you've given it a good crack, don't quit. But if there's something else going, apply for it or apply for things as they come, but don't quit your job. And then if you get a job that you'd rather, then if you get the job, then you can move jobs. Because it's fine for now, but I can just tell that I'm kind of getting sick of it already 
and not sick of it as in I'm lazy, I'm sick of it, sick of it as in just the whole thing, like, uh, I want to give away where I work, you know, in case I get, like, stalked, not that that's really going to happen, but, um, working with kids and having to fit an item of clothing for them, <laughs> shoes, um, it's, I don't know, it's very tedious, it's very annoying, especially when they don't know what they want, I don't know, my mum's probably going to watch this and then be like, don't quit your job, blah, blah, blah. But mum, listen. No, I'll talk to her about it before this goes up. But no, yeah, I'm just going to think. I'm just going to have a browse. Apply for some things. There's already some things I want to apply for. And then we'll see what happens. Like, I'm not going to quit. I don't really need to. I don't feel like I need to. But I know from my old job, if it keeps going this way, I'm going to get completely fed up with it extremely quickly. And then I probably will end up quitting, which isn't what I want to do because I'm really loving the money right now. So, yeah, that's my motivational chat. Don't change it at first if you hate it, but if you hate it, or not hate it, but still don't enjoy it that much after a good few weeks of whatever it is, then look for something else. Is that motivational? I don't know. Don't give up. That's my... <laughs> don't give up. <laughs> Be happy. I'm going to go home now. Bye. <laughs> so guys, I today... I'm proud to announce that I've landed some work experience at a salon, you know, that's local in the area. And I'm very excited because I need work experience to finish my TAFE course and now I'm finally going to start some. And I'm very excited and I really hope it goes well because I'm, I'm excited but I'm also, I feel like I'm more nervous and excited about it, which is just me. But I also, like, I'm gr so grateful and I'm glad because I really need it. But I just really, really hope that it works out and that it's suits me and like you know what I mean and that I enjoy it and that I don't kind of hate it because I need to do it anyway so even if I hate it I'm just gonna have to get through it because I need to do it so I'm really praying that that works out and I'm also just watching some YouTube now and I just finished watching the new season of Orange is the New Black on Netflix and what the heck it ended on such a cliffhanger I didn't think it was gonna end that quickly like I feel like it was really short like I've, I've are the other seasons that short? I can't remember. But it ended on such a cliffhanger and I'm so annoyed. So if anyone else watches it and they've watched the end of season six already, please hit me up in the comments because I want to talk about it with someone. And so yeah, it's Friday and so I just had that interview today for work experience. Tomorrow I'm working, tomorrow Saturday I'm working and then yeah. I'm going to try and edit my vlog tomorrow so this is probably going to be like one of the last clips you'll see this week. Depends on what happens tomorrow. If anything interesting happens, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah. So my day's been pretty good and productive. What about your guys' days? How has your day been? Let me know down below. I'd love to know how your day's been because I, I keep playing with my hair. Oh my god. Because, you know, it's nice to know. Was it good? Was it bad? Tell me your favourite thing about your day right now in the comments. Leave it down below and I'll try... Uh, I'll try to reply. I will reply. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys are having a great day.